Let's hear the story of the cornea. Once upon a time, there was a special part of the eye called the cornea. The cornea can be visualized as a convex lens. It has a curved shape resembling a dome or a portion of a sphere. A normal cornea is typically transparent and clear. Its clarity allows light to pass through it without significant scattering or distortion. This transparency is crucial for the proper functioning of the eye as it allows light to reach the retina and form a clear image. However, sometimes the cornea loses its transparency causing vision to fade away. This occurrence in cases of corneal ulcers, scarring, advanced keratoconus where the cornea thins out and bulges like a cone and corneal dystrophy, genetic eye disorders characterized by abnormal changes or degeneration of the cornea. When faced with such challenges, a beacon of hope emerged. Corneal Transplantation What is corneal transplantation? Corneal transplantation, also known as corneal grafting or keratoplasty, is a remarkable surgical procedure that offers renewed hope for those with damaged or diseased corneas. Its goal is to improve vision and provide relief from various corneal conditions. During this procedure, a skilled surgeon delicately removes the central portion of the patient's affected cornea. Then, like a gift of sight, a healthy cornea obtained from a generous deceased donor is meticulously transplanted. There are various types of corneal transplant procedures, each tailored to address specific needs. Let's explore a few of them together. In therapeutic penetrating keratoplasty, the procedure is done in case of ulcers where all clinical management of removing the infection did not yield results. The entire diseased cornea was gently removed and replaced with a donor cornea. This procedure focuses on eliminating infections and promoting healing. Penetrating keratoplasty is another remarkable procedure. It involves removing the scarred cornea and replacing it with a donor cornea, stitching it to restore vision. Deep anterior lamellar keratoplasty or DALK targets cases of advanced keratoconus. The anterior part of the cornea is skillfully replaced with a similar thickness of a donor cornea, allowing for renewed strength and clarity. For specific endothelial diseases like Fuchs dystrophy or pseudophagic bullous keratopathy, the brilliant minds in ophthalmology introduced DSAEK and DMEK procedures. These techniques involve replacing the posterior part of the cornea with thin strip donor tissue or donor tissue alone, respectively. After the surgery, the journey to restored vision continues with dedicated post-operative care. Remember, regular follow-ups are vital to monitor your progress. Please reframe from rubbing your eyes, avoid head baths or bathing in ponds and diligently follow the prescribed eye drop regime. For those who underwent DSAEK and DMEK, resting in a supine position allows the graft to settle well. Any transplant procedure is subject to failure. In the case of transplantation, the cornea may be rejected. So, regular follow-up is essential. This will help identify the early stage of rejection and the experts can prevent it through rigorous and well-monitored treatment. And so with time, patience and expert care, patients began to witness the miraculous transformation. Their pain diminished, their vision returned and hope was restored. The gift of corneal transplantation changed lives, enabling individuals to see the beauty of the world once again. Thanks to the tireless efforts of the doctors, countless lives have been touched, bringing a ray of light to those once lost in darkness. If you or your loved ones are facing corneal challenges, reach out to a nearby eye specialist. Let us embark on a journey together where our goal is to restore vision and make dreams become clearer.